The Ohio Bobcats had their first game in Athens this season as they took on Marshall in the battle for the bell. Marshall came in winning their last 11 games and looked to add another early as Maya Stevenson hit a solo home run to left field to start off the night. They had one more run in the first to make it two to nothing. Mackenzie Cole was on the mound for the Bobcats and after a shaky start, she threw three scoreless innings heading into the fifth. Then the thundering herd broke through again in the fifth. With the bases loaded, Allie Harrell singles up the middle to extend the Marshall lead three to nothing. The thundering herd would add four more runs to have a six run lead late in the game. The Bobcats went into the bottom of the sixth inning down seven to one, but it's not about how you start, it's about how you finish. After a leadoff home run by Tori Walker, the Bobcats put two more on base, which brought up Megan McMenemy, who smoked one high and deep into center and got it over the wall for a three run home run to make it seven to five. We head to the bottom of the seventh. The Bobcats have the bases loaded with one out. Reagan Farmer hits a sharp grounder to shortstop and she'll commit an error, which allowed two runs to score, and we are tied seven to seven. Next batter, Caitlin Fogue hits a grounder to first and gets tagged out, but this allows Tori Walker to race home and she slides in to beat the tag. And the Bobcats complete the comeback and win this one eight to seven. Fought their ass off. I mean, that's it. They just they fought and they fought hard. Um, that's that's just the name of that. They they didn't want to take um, they didn't want to take that and they decided they were going to get up there and get the job done. They just, they fought. That was what it was. Grit. With the win, the Bobcats snap Marshall's 11-game win streak. Next, they'll travel to a four-game series with the Buffalo Bulls starting on Friday. For Bobcats Showcase, I'm Reese Thompson.